Welcome to AirVenture 2015, which was held July 20th to the 26th. AirVenture is getting so large that there's now two special event stations on site. To give you a perspective of how large this event is, it's approximately three miles by two miles wide. So let's join Randy, K7AGE, as he visits the W9ZL special event station. Hello, I'm Randy, K7AGE at the EAA, the Experimental Aircraft Association's big fly-in in Oshkosh, Wisconsin. And I'm here with John at one of the special event stations. So, hello. Hi, John, AB9AH with the Fox Cities Amateur Radio Club. And we're here at the W9ZL Air Venture 2015 Special Event Station. For the past 20 plus years, we've been running a special event station at the EAA Air Venture fly-in show every year. We run two HF stations here, one on 20 meters, one on 40 meters. Uh, outside here we have John uh, KC9FMC and he's got a 20 meter station that he's manning. Uh, he's running a Yesu FT1000 and that is being run up through a, uh, oh, a vertical. Uh, inside we're running a, uh, an ICOM uh, 756 Pro up into a dipole on 20 meters. Cool. We average probably, if the bands permit, three to 400 contacts, and usually about 100 certificates go out every year. Very good, I uh, want you to fill me in a little bit on the tower that's holding up one end of the dipoles here. Beacon tower, which had a light beacon on it and the uh, AM uh, beacon transmitter antenna on it. Buildings we're operating out of is called Lone Rock Service Station. Uh, these two buildings were originally located in the southwest portion of Wisconsin in the town of Lone Rock, and this was at a uh, local airport down there. This was a generator shack next to here. This was the actual service station. Wow, that's pretty neat. So, um, how many operators do you have staff in the station? Uh, there's 11 scheduled per day. For the station is one of the longest operating per man hour basis. We operate for five straight days here and I have a total of I think 23 people on staff for me this year. So I imagine you have a lot of QSL cards and certificates to send out after the air adventure. Oh yes, uh, we'll average at about 600 contacts like I said during this event and I've got a 20 to 30 percent return ratio on uh, cards per contact so I'll be busy for probably 16, 20 hours uh, replying and getting out the certificate for the year. Well, thank you very much. The, um, of course, this is going to be airing after the Air Adventure closes, so I hope everybody has already worked you here. Okay, and I hope that it serves as a reminder for everybody that worked me to get those QSL cards out to the club, and you'll be getting a certificate from me a little later in the year. John, thank you from Ham Nation and, and all of our viewers. Thank you very much. And I visited Whiskey 9 Whiskey in the Warbirds area. This is Dan, N9LVS. I'm here at the Warbirds area of AirVenture 2015, and I'm here with Ed, uh, K9ECF. He's running the Warbirds uh, special event station at AirVenture. We were at a Warbirds of America board meeting uh, some months ago and discovered that, unbeknownst to each of us, that all of us were HAM members and did not know that at the time. So we decided to try an initiative this year of setting up a special events radio station in the Warbirds of, of America area. The call sign for the special event station is Whiskey 9 Whiskey or Whiskey 9 Warbirds. Trying an experiment, all HAMs who happen to be in the area are, are welcome to uh, come by the radio station, make a few contacts. We uh, hope to do this every year. Uh, we try to operate it from 9 to 5 p.m. in shifts as much as we can. With uh, generous help from uh, ICOM, we have uh, a state-of-the-art ICOM 7851 uh, radio, which is set radio set up, the 746 and the 7851. And we are, whatever bands are open, we'll try to make a few contacts. If you're interested in further information about the Warbirds of America or what we do here with uh, the Warbirds in the old World War II, Korean War, Vietnam, Gulf War vintage aircraft, you can go to warbirds-eaa.org. Again, that's warbirds with an S-eaa.org. And that's the two special event stations at AirVenture 2015, W9ZL and Whiskey 9 Whiskey. With Randy, K7AGE, I'm Dan, N9LVS, bidding you 73s from AirVenture 2015.